Witajcie, czy zakochany kamera powróci? Dzisiaj się dowiemy, ponieważ mamy tu jakieś przecieki i to Mobi tutaj coś nam poopowiada. Zapraszam, obejrzyjmy sobie wspólnie, komentujmy razem i oczywiście wasze teorie na końcu. Lecimy. And this character is of course Simp Cameraman. Okay, twierdzą, że Simp ten zakochany kamera powróci. Ciekawe. Aside from those that were also mentioned by Boom who were expected to return. We have already seen the promised return of Mecha Scientist Cameraman in episode 72. No tak, Boom powiedział, że kamera naukowiec wróci i to się sprawdziło i powiedział, że zakochany kamera również wróci, bo naukowiec wrócił, no to to się pewnie też sprawdzi. And by the way, recently we have received the full version of this episode with the new secret scene added to it by Boom, which also contained one really cool detail as well, and I'll talk about it at the end of the video. I'd also like to talk about the celebration in the name of 40 million subscribers that Boom had a few days ago. No, 40 million subscribers. Gift that he posted to celebrate this, as it also contains some interesting details. Tak, okay, dobra. I'm sharing my theories with you on why we can see Simp Cameraman returning to this series and why and what kind of plot twist connected to him we may see. So get your tea and snacks ready and prepare to watch this video to the end because I saved something really special by its end. And let's go. But before diving deep into the gif filled with Easter eggs no, by Boom, let me remind you guys real quick on who Simp Cameraman was in his glorious days. No, that's the iconic camera, yeah. Why he was so loved by the Scabidi community, myself included. He is, in fact, one of the most famous Scabidi characters in the history of Scabidi. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared in the full version of First Flight Simulator in the series. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared in the full version of First Flight Simulator in the series. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared in the full version of First Flight Simulator in the series. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared in the full version of First Flight Simulator in the series. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared in the full version of First Flight Simulator in the series. He is, in fact, one of the oldest characters of the series who appeared but then we started seeing the quick and impressive rise of Plungerman while Simp Cameraman was somewhat sent to the background. But for the eyes of Skibidi fans, everything changed in episode 49. When Simp Cameraman saw TV Woman for the first time and got absolutely smitten with her. Relatively speaking, he's got the name Simp Cameraman. To on był tutaj przetransportowany? Instead of just plain boring brown coat Cameraman. Już nie pamiętam. After this exact episode was released. And the most iconic episode where he was featured was, of course, episode 54, where he dresses up to impress TV woman and waits for her tenderly to just then get ghosted by her as she did not even allow him to hug her. And starting with this episode, his tragic love arc with TV woman unravels really rapidly. In episode 57, Simp Cameraman gets hurt alongside with Plungerman as they both try to help the Alliance soldiers with the mission of curing the infected Titan Speaker Man. And here happens one of the most infamous scenes in Skibidi Toilet Series history. Tak, ona go tam olała, nie? When TV Woman saves Plungerman, but leaves Simp Cameraman behind, all injured and broken, not even trying to teleport back once again to save him. And I bet this betrayal from his most loved one must have could change him and his whole personality forever. No, może coś tam być, że to przez te takie za, wiecie, złamana miłość, zawiedziona miłość, może doprowadzić do jakiś. Złych przemian, nie? But as I don't to lose the bits of hope for good, I'd say that I still see two options for Simp Cameraman. He might stay the same nice guy, or he might start seeking revenge for real. But I'll tell you everything in details about my theories on his character later in this video, so keep watching it not to miss the most interesting part. No dobra, zobaczmy. So now, as you remembered everything you had to about Simp Cameraman, let's get back to the present days. So the first mention of Simp Cameraman happened long before the celebrating gif that Boom posted in his YouTube community notes, and it was something that shook me to my core because I have almost lost any hope to hear the name of Simp Cameraman at that point. It happened when the Russian Skibidi creator named Armhov reached out to Boom and asked him several questions about the future plot no, on tutaj się zapytał, nie? of the series. And one of the questions was dedicated to Simp Cameraman specifically, which made me and the rest of the community really happy. And by the way, just as Boom loves staying in touch with multiple Skibidi YouTubers, I also like keeping the special bond with you guys. So if you like the idea of chatting with... Okay, no to tutaj oczywiście reklama. Boom about which sounded like Will we ever see Simp Cameraman again? And in response to that, the Boom's answer was, "It's possible." And I cannot even describe to you guys. No, on powiedział, że to tylko możliwe, ale wydaje mi się, że na pewno się pojawi. Tym bardziej, że dużo osób chciałoby nie tę postać, żeby wróciła. How happy I was at that moment, because it seemed like my prayers were finally heard by Skibidi Jesus from Boom's lucid dream. 
And I mean, yeah, Boom didn't give us any specific details in that answer whatsoever. But at least he didn't say no. No, Plus, nie considering nie. how often he started tracking back to his old characters or episodes of the series, it's entirely possible that such a beloved and hyped character as Simp Cameraman will not be ignored by its maker any longer. And what made me excited about it even more is the fact that Mecha Scientist Cameraman's return was also mentioned by another Russian YouTuber called. No, właśnie, potwierdza się to, co mówi Boom, więc to jest akurat pozytywne. Zobacz, no niestety co do daty, e, daty oczywiście wychodzenia odcinków, no to tutaj Boom się zawsze myli, nie? And it came to be entirely true in episode 72. And don't forget another important thing is that the return of Plungerman and the Dark Speakerman was also in question by Arm Hov. And to that Boom it also answered that it's possible that it's gonna happen. And these two characters are also really iconic and loved by the entire Skibidi community, so I'm not fully excluding the possibility of them to also epically reappear in this series, and that's why some of my theories regarding Simp Cameraman will be connected to them and Mecha Scientist as well. And now let's finally move to this really cool gift that Boom had posted in his community posts to celebrate the 40 million subscribers he now has, And by the way, guys, be sure to congratulate our buddy Boom in the comments below as well. No, 40 million subscribers. To jest niesamowita ilość, naprawdę. Because it would be really wholesome. To jest wielki sukces i cieszę się z tego. We can see multiple key characters of Skibidi Toilet Universe, and I am sure that you are well acquainted with them all. So let's not list them all, but highlight those I was not actually expecting to see here. So at first I thought that Boom intended to list those characters who are still alive in his universe and may continue playing important roles in the future episodes, which also includes some characters no, that dobra, no, came back after nico. a long hiatus, such as Mecha Scientist. Ciekawe, co on tam wypatrzył ciekawego, nie? Cameraman. But what interested me the most in this picture is that Plungerman and the Dark Speakerman were also featured in this GIF together with the alive characters such as the female squad and the titans. No, and so were they included simply because they've already done so much important for the alliance up to episode 70? Or maybe it's connected to what Boom said about them? Namely how there is still a possibility out there for us to see them returning back to the... Nie no, tak jak mówię, ninja to na pewno wróci, ten plunger, natomiast dark, no to tutaj mam wątpliwości co do tego. Someday. Honestly, I'd really love to believe that plus there is one more detail in this gif that feeds my hope. Look at the cameraman on the very right standing isolated from the rest no, to of the crew and doing nothing chyba, at all. No dancing, no anything. And of course, lots of people including myself saw no other than simp cameraman in this figure whom we didn't see since episode 57 already. And considering how lonely he is in this gif, I have plenty of thoughts to say. Firstly, what if there's a possibility that when he appears in the series, he won't be really on anybody's side, by which I mean the alliance. So będzie kolejna jakby kolejna nie rasa, tylko kolejna strona w tym konflikcie. Ciekawe, nie? What if this guy would feel so betrayed after everything he went through in episode 57, but managed to survive somehow? Chyba, że będzie robił dla agenta, nie? That from now on he would Sekretnego. persist his own goals and probably consider revenge towards the alliance and TV woman specifically. But in case of such a theory, I'd say that there wouldn't be really clear how exactly would he be able to survive and get repaired if not for the help from any of the sides in this war. So I would lean more to another theories I have in store for this guy. So imagine the following course of events. <coughs> After the terrible injury that Simp suffered in the second part of episode 57, it is still possible that he will survive and be safely taken to the cameraman's laboratory by the Też mi się tak wydaje, że oni go wzięli po prostu do bazy, nie? No przecież zbierają swoje The Alliance engineers or medics, which would mean that it's possible for him to still get help from the Alliance, although not from TV. Może zostanie też jakimś mechem albo coś. specifically and there he could have been upgraded by no other than Mecha Scientist himself, who suffered exactly the same injury in episode 48, so he already knows what to do in cases like this. So following this scenario, we would see the return of Simp Cameraman dressed in the robotic exosuit as well. No and właśnie. at this point, Też o tym pomyślałem, nie? he and the Mecha Scientist could behave like comrades in arms, which would be really exciting for me to see. But to tell you honestly, guys, I like the third option much better. Although this scenario would be much darker and sharper than the ones I talked about before. Because if we remember the secret ending scene of the full version of episode 70 once again, 
Then it would become obvious for us that in this facility full of previously injured cameramen that were then taken to this facility and repaired from the scratch, no trace of simp cameraman can be noticed. No, tutaj go nie ma, no. And that could only mean one thing. Co, Skibidi go wzięli? Even if he was still alive, then no one from the Alliance had picked him up, so he must have been left all alone on the battlefield from episode 57. And that he was betrayed not only by his beloved TV woman, but also by the entire Alliance in this sense. So maybe he was picked up by someone from the Skibidi army for some reason. Perhaps in order to get some information from him about the Alliance's plans or to attract him to their side as a spy. Tego. And in this case, we can see the return of the simp Mutanta. cameraman as an agent from the side of the Skibidi, who from now on will either fight against the Alliance or be sent as a spy similar to Lucky Cameraman no, who works on the jest, secret nie? agent at the moment. And I think that option would be just mind-blowing <coughs> to see. And plus, it wouldn't contradict the events on the Celebration's GIF where he can be noticed standing aside from everyone else as they are not his friends any longer. And by the way, do you remember the secret scene from the full version of episode 72? No, właśnie, to In my ten. analysis of it, I suspected that the figure of this mysterious cameraman that we saw vanishing in the thin air could also be Simp Cameraman. Although it's really hard to say at this point. No, to by było ciężko, no ale na pewno, na pewno zakochany kamera powróci, to jest pewne. No i oczywiście przejdziemy do waszych sobie teorii i komentarzy. No dobra, zasubskrybuję, przekonałeś mnie. No i to się rozumie, dziękuję bardzo. Subskrybujcie moje inne kanały YouTube. To jest zwykłe światło. No właśnie. Pytanie, czy to jest zielone, czy zwykłe? Hmm, po co nosi maskę? Może em, design? Tutaj chodzi o astro toaletę, tak? Nie no, słuchajcie, zazwyczaj te toalety nie mają maski. Jest to zrobione specjalnie, tak jakby Bum chciał po prostu kogoś ukryć. Mam teorię, że w tych boksach, co skibit toalet noszą, to tam są ręce, nogi i tp Gmana. No, nie zdziwiłbym się, jakby rzeczywiście była taka ostateczna jakby pomoc dla Gmana, który by miał nogi i ręce i stałby się tytanem. No, to by było ciekawe. Już du od dawna o tym mówię, że Gman po powoli przeistacza się w takiego tytana. Brod, pamiętasz jak miałem teorię o tym Skibidi Kocie i miałem trochę racji? Tak, Bartoszu, zgadzam się, miałeś troszkę racji. Ale ta energia jest Gmana. Gman nie mógł tego przecież ukraść, bo jak i kiedy? Mówisz o energii tego kontroli, co g wystrzelił te kule. Tam ewidentnie był kolor tv Mena i to jest ukradziona technologia tv Mena. Także to jest bez... Nie ma co do tego krzty wątpliwości. Fioletowy promień jest kolorem tv Mena. Mam coś do powiedzenia. Tytani mogą użyć broni, jak Tytan tv Men mógłby pokazać całą swoją moc. Naś, naś... A Tytan... E, ti, speaker Man może polecić, a Tytan Cameraman poleci do naprawienia siebie, a Tytan TV może skończyć walkę. E, to znaczy, wydaje mi się, że raczej tutaj prawdopodobnie Tytan Głośnik zginie i oni wszyscy Tytani będą walczyć z g -Manem. Natomiast, e, no, prawdopodobnie g przeżyje tę walkę. 